then classification next point is classification of monohalogen derivative then this monohalogen derivative monohalogen derivatives means compound containing only one halogen atom monohalogen derivative means we already learned here compound containing only one halogen atoms this monohalogen derivatives these are classified on the basis of type of hybridization these are classified on the type of hybridization and position of halogen atom on the basis of type of hybridization and position of halogen atoms these are mainly classified in three parts or three class that is first one compound containing c sp3 x halogen atom that means this halogen atom is attached to sp3 type of hybridized carbon atom then second one these are classified carbon containing sp2 x that is halogen atom which is attached to sp2 type of hybridized carbon atom and third one carbon containing sp x that is halogen atom which bonded to sp type of hybridized carbon atom these are mainly classified into three classes first one sp3 carbon containing halogen which attached to sp3 type of hybridized carbon atom halogen attached to sp2 type of hybridized carbon atom and third one halogen attached to sp type of hybridized carbon atom then these are classified this sp2 sp3 type of hybridized carbon atom these are again classified into main three class that is first one is called as alkyl halides first one is called as alkyl halides first one alkyl halides then second one that is allylic halides second one allylic halides and third one that is benzylic halides third one benzylic halides alkyl halides allylic halides alkyl halides allylic halides and third one benzylic halides then what is alkyl halides alkyl halides means suppose r ch2 x alkyl halides means suppose r ch2 x that is this halogen atom is attached to this sp3 type of hybridized carbon atom this carbon atom is bonded to single bond carbon carbon single bond hence it is called as sp3 type of hybridized carbon atom then allylic halides allylic halides means r ch2 ch double bond ch ch2 x in this compound this halogen atom is bonded to again sp3 type of hybridized carbon atom this carbon atom is also sp3 type of hybridized carbon atom but next to carbon carbon double bond this sp3 type of hybridized carbon atom is attached to carbon carbon double bond which carrying carbon carbon double bond such type of compounds are called as allylic halides then third one benzylic halides benzylic halides means suppose this is benzyl group that is c6h5ch2 this compound is called as benzyl group and halogen atom is bonded to this carbon atom of this benzyl group hence it is called as benzylic halide again this carbon atom is also sp3 type of hybridized carbon atom all these carbon atom this carbon atom of alkyl halides this carbon atom of al allylic halides and this carbon atom of this benzylic halides these are called as sp3 type of hybridized carbon atom this is called as alkyl halide this is called as allylic halide and it is called as benzylic halide then these alkyl halides benz allylic halides and benzylic halides these are also classified as primary alkyl halide 
secondary alkyl halide and tertiary alkyl halides these are also classified as first one primary alkyl halide second one secondary alkyl halide and third one that is tertiary alkyl halides then what is primary alkyl halides suppose this example that is r ch2 x this is example of primary alkyl halide because this halogen atom is bonded to this primary carbon atom this carbon atom it is first degree carbon atom it is called as primary alkyl halides then secondary alkyl halide suppose r c r h x this halogen atom is bonded to this carbon atom which is a secondary carbon atom this halogen atom bonded to this carbon atom this is secondary carbon atom because this is again bonded to two carbon atoms this alkyl group alkyl group means this carbon atom is attached to two carbon atoms this is bonded to two carbon atoms hence it is called as secondary alkyl halide then third one tertiary alkyl halides that is here r c r r and x in this compound this x x means halogen is bonded to this carbon atom this is third degree carbon atom third degree carbon atom is this is tertiary carbon atom because this carbon atom is bonded to three carbon atom this is bonded to three carbon atom this is called as tertiary carbon atom in this way also this allylic halides and benzylic halides this may be primary alkyl halides secondary alkyl halides and tertiary alkyl halides suppose this is example of primary alkyl halides this carbon atom is bonded to this carbon atom this again bonded to one carbon atom hence this is example of primary carbon atom this is example of primary then secondary alkyl halides of this suppose benzylic halides is suppose this benzene nucleus this ch r and x this is example of this secondary benzylic halides means this x is bonded to this carbon atom is attached to two carbon atom which two carbon atom one carbon atom of this benzene nucleus and one carbon atom of this alkyl groups in this way this is example of secondary alcohol then third example of tertiary alcohol of this benzylic halides suppose this is benzene ring here c r r and here x in this compound this halogen atom is bonded to this carbon atom this is third degree that is tertiary carbon atom because this carbon atom is bonded to three carbon atoms one carbon atom of this benzene nucleus and two carbon atom of this alkyl group in this way this first one that is c sp3 x that is halogen atom bonded to sp3 type of hybridized carbon atom these are classified as alkyl halides allylic halides and benzylic halides then second one that is second type of sp2 x carbon atom that means halogen atom is bonded to sp2 type of hybridized carbon atom these are again classified as these are again classified as that is vinyl halides vinyl halides these are classified as vinyl halides and second one that is aryl halides second one aryl halides or this is also called as halo arenes that is halo aryl halides or halo arenes then what is vinyl halides vinyl halides means suppose ch2 double bond ch x in this compound this halogen atom is bonded to this carbon atom which bonded to carbon carbon double bond hence this type of carbon atom is sp2 type of hybridized carbon atom this carbon atom having here carbon carbon double bond hence this carbon atom is a sp2 type of hybridized carbon atom and this halogen atom 
is bonded to this sp2 type of hybridized carbon atom such compounds are called as vinyl halides and this compound is suppose here chlorine atom then this compound is called as a vinyl chloride then second one aryl halides or haloaryls in aryl halides suppose this benzene nucleus benzene ring and here one of this hydrogen atom is replaced by halogen atom or halogen atom directly bonded to this benzene ring it is called as aryl halides or haloaryls aryl halides or haloaryls there is difference in benzylic halides and aryl halides what is difference in aryl halides this halogen atom is directly bonded to benzene nucleus and in this benzylic halide this halogen atom is bonded to carbon atom of this benzyl group this is two are different aryl halides and benzylic halides benzylic halides is a sp3 type of hybridized carbon atom and in aryl halides that is there are sp2 type of hybridized carbon atom then third one that is spx that is halogen atom are bonded to sp type of hybridized carbon atom for example ch triple bond cx in this compound these are also called as halo that is uh, halo alkynes these are called as halo alkynes in this compound this halogen atom bonded to this carbon atom the type of this carbon atom is sp type of hybridized carbon atom because on this carbon atom there is carbon carbon triple bond hence it is called as sp type of hybridized carbon atom and name of this compound is halo alkynes in this way there is very easy to remember the classification of this halogen derivative by this diagram by this flow sheet diagram that is you easily remember what is the classification of this or which compound having which type of hybridized carbon atom these are always asked in mcqs the type of hybridized carbon atom you are given some example and ask the type of following compound is dash that is whether type of sp3 type of hybridized sp2 type of or sp in this way this is easy to remember the type of hybridized carbon atom by this diagram